what's up everybody it's Ennis here and today we're touring Picasso's newest listing in Vail, Colorado. Scenery here is amazing, beautiful contemporary mountainside home. Here are the specs on this property and you can acquire one eighth ownership of this home for $2,225,000. As always you can find more information about this listing in the description of this video. Make sure to check it out. Big thanks to Picasso and now let's begin. Welcome to Vail, Colorado everyone. This place is gorgeous. I'm really excited for today's tour. And we're gonna start here on the exterior. Driveway brings you to the two car garage, nicely paved. You can easily park six to eight cars here. And looking at the facade, it's a beautiful contemporary mountainside home, nicely integrated to the hillside. And on the exterior, we have wood siding, aluminum panels, massive windows, and stack stone and all these materials contrast nicely with each other and give this house a very contemporary look if you look above you can see some of the cantilevered roof lines and balconies a lot of outdoor spaces and lastly we have the walkway here taking us to the entry planters on each side and we have the door here let's go inside here we are at the entry beautiful solid door. I love this steel accent piece that serves as the handle and coming to the entry, double height ceilings, stacked stone on my right hand side. Love these modern wall sconces, ton of natural light coming in. And on this level, we have two bedrooms. I wanna first take you guys to this hallway because this opening takes us to the two bedrooms. At the end of this hallway, we have a spacious laundry room, two washers, two dryers, cabinetry sink, and then we have the hallway leading us this way where we have the first bedroom suite, good sized room, light well around the corner, comes with a full bathroom, two sink, just a great size room. Now, I wanna take you guys back to the hallway because we have this opening taking us to the bunk room, four single beds, room is really well dressed. I love the built-ins here with steel and woodwork. And since we have a great ceiling height, it just gives more volume to these built-ins. Full glass assembly here facing the front, TV around the corner, just a cozy room. Now going back to the hallway, built-in closets here, and this door opens up to a full bathroom, textured tiles on the floor, water closet, spacious walk-in shower. I love the mosaic back wall, brushed nickel fixtures, and we have the vanity here with a concrete vessel sink, looks great. And that's it for the bunk room. Now let's go back to the hallway so we can continue our tour on the first floor. Coming back here on our left hand side, we have the elevator access. This opening takes us to the mud room, built-ins on each side, open shelving, wall sconces. This door opens up to the utility room and we have boot warmers here, which is just a nice detail to have in a house like this where you live in this amazing environment during winter. This comes in really handy, pretty spacious. Just a good sized mudroom. Now, going back to the entry, we have the staircase leading us to the second floor, but before I go up there, we actually have the staircase here going down to the lower level where we have the two car garage and your elevator access. And lastly, like I mentioned, we have the staircase here taking us to the second floor of this property. Landing is super bright. We have all these windows facing the amazing views. And coming this way, we have this awesome seating area. Table set up on my left. Couch set up here. Two beautiful leather chairs. You have your TV mounted to the wall. And we have sliding glass doors open up to a patio space where we have the hot tub. That patio also faces these amazing views. Now coming this way, hallway closet. And around the corner, we have this door opening up to a powder room for the common areas. And at the end of the hallway, we have a door taking us to the only bedroom suite on this level. Comes with a full bathroom, two sinks, walk-in shower, and that bedroom also opens up to the patio that I just mentioned. Now, coming back here, we have the elevator access 
for this level and the staircase leading us to the third floor. And this is where we have the kitchen and the seating area. But before I cover this space, I actually wanna take everybody this way. We have this door opening up to the first bedroom suite on this level. Off of the entry, you have your bathroom, floating vanity, lovely cabinetry with these built-in handles, two sinks, textured back wall, LED lit mirror. We have the water closet here. On the floor, we have these terrazzo tiles, which give you this timeless look. And you have your walk-in shower here with a built-in bench. Looks great, brush nickel fixtures. Now, coming back to the hallway, this is where you have your walk-in closet. And this opening takes us to the bedroom itself, king size bed, across from the bed, we have the gas fireplace with the stone wall, TV above, and of course we have sliding glass doors opening up to a private patio dedicated for this room. Ton of natural light coming in, awesome space. This is the only bedroom suite we have on this level. Now, let's go back to the landing so we can continue our tour. Off of the landing, we have this dining area. Love the solid wood table that sits eight people. And look at this space. We have sliding glass doors opening up to the outdoors. Seating area looks great. And this house is professionally managed and furnished by Picasso. We tour their properties all the time. And when you buy a share with Picasso, not only you get the right to use the property, but you also own that much of the property, which is great as the property value goes up, you as the homeowner benefit from that. And let's say you wanna use the property more than 45 days out of a year, you can simply acquire more shares, which is awesome. Point is, rather than spending 16, 17 million dollars, and buying a property like this where you have to manage it yourself, Picasso takes care of everything for you and you can buy as many shares as you need to get the best out of your vacation home. And this one is awesome. I wish I have the money to buy some shares here. Uh, by the way, I forgot to mention, Dal's behind the camera today. Dal, how are you enjoying the scenery here in Vail, Colorado? Oh, I'm loving it. It's a nice change up from LA. We should do some more homes out here. I know, we should come here during winter uh, if Mikey was behind the camera, he would say, Enes, we need to come here during winter and we need to go skiing. Hopefully this year we make that happen. But yeah, we have Dal behind the camera and uh, we have the seating area on this side. But first, I actually want to take everybody this way so we can cover the kitchen. Island in the center with a bar seating, pendant lights above, waterfall edge on this side. And your main sink is located on the island. Dishwashers on this side. Coming back here, we have a small vet bar complementing your dining area, sink, wine fridge, some open shelving. Your paneled fridge and freezer is on this side. Next to that, your base cabinets continue. Wolf gas stove built in. And I really like how they have the same stone as the countertop on the front where you have the knobs. It just creates a nice contrast. Your vent is above, LED lit cabinetry, backsplash, house is nicely furnished. You have everything you need. You have your spice rack here. I mean, they literally thought of everything and that's why it's so nice to have a Picasso home where you can just come in and enjoy rather than worry about whether you have all the right spices, whether you have your nice or not, they take care of everything for you. It's pretty awesome. Now, we have the microwave here, oven down below, pantry space, and your kitchen flows straight to your seating area, facing the views, nice and open. I really like the ceiling design here where we have these dark beams contrasting nicely against the wood plank ceiling. Seating area looks great. Fireplace around the corner, TV above, sliding glass doors open up to the patio and we have additional sliding glass doors opening up to the outdoor dining area where we have the built-in barbecue. Now coming this way, let's take everybody outside. Also in this corner, we have the elevator access and sliding glass doors open up to the front facing balcony and look at these views. Right in front of us, we have the Lion's Head Village. It looks so charming. You're minutes away from restaurants and bars. We're looking at these amazing mountain views. You're 500 feet away from Simba Ski Run and I'm sure this place looks incredible during winter. But yeah, this is your front facing balcony and these are the views that you're looking at. Now, that's it for our tour on this level. I wanna take everybody back to the staircase so we can continue our tour on the fourth floor. Around the corner, we have the hallway taking us to the elevator access. Off of the landing, we have a desk, modern wall sconces, ton of natural light coming in. And going this way, we have 
this door, opening up to a small room where you can use it as an office or a den. I like this linear window detail facing the back of the property. And lastly, we have this door opening up to the primary bedroom suite. This bedroom is great. And first, I wanna start our tour with the bathroom, which starts right here. Marble floors throughout, and the same marble was also used in the walk-in shower. Floating vanity here with two sinks, LED lit mirror, and around the corner, you have a gorgeous concrete freestanding tub with a chandelier above. Then you have a spacious walk-in shower that faces the amazing views, brush nickel fixtures, and the same marble was used all the way to the ceiling. You have your water closet here with a total toilet. This is super cool. Washer and dryer for the primary bedroom suite. And lastly, we have this door opening up to the walk-in closet, island in the center, ton of cabinetry, hangar space, open shelving, and we have another window here for your natural light. Now, I wanna take everybody back to the main hallway so we can check out the bedroom itself, which starts here, king-size bed, hardwood floors, tall ceilings, all these windows are bringing so much natural light. It's super private up here. It's just a cozy bedroom. Same ceiling detail that we saw at the seating area. They have it also here. Contrasts nicely with these white walls. Around the corner, you have a gas fireplace, TV above, beautiful textures. And lastly, we have sliding glass doors opening up to the back patio, which is another great outdoor space, built-in planters. And I love the view on the back where we have these tall trees and you can see the same view from these windows as well. Just a beautiful property. Vale is awesome. And I hope in the future we come here again. All right, everyone, that's it for the tour. Hope you all enjoyed this video. As always, you can find more information about this listing in the description of this video, so make sure to check that out. I wanna give big thanks to Pakasso for making this tour possible, and if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give us a like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next week.